In this video, I'm going to show you how to upload all the files to your website through the FileZilla FTP application. So, of course, you need to install FileZilla, and I showed you where to get FileZilla in the second video, or the earlier videos. Uh, so go ahead and do that if you haven't. And in order to connect to your website, you need to have a web hosting account. When you create the web hosting account, they're going to give you information like host, username, and password. So enter that into here, which is normally going to look like FTP dot whatever your domain is dot com, your username, and then your password. Once you're done with that, click on Quick Connect, and you will be sent to that page. Now, before I do anything more, I want to go to the folder at which the files are located. So the files are located here. And I find the easiest way, if you're using a Windows system, is to locate the folder at, at to which it's located and click on the top here. It's going to share with you the location, you know, where it is. So right click and copy. Go back over here. And FileZilla is split up into two sections. This section over here is the your computer section. So if I go here and right click, paste, enter, that's the files that I've been working on. The right side here is your website. So when I connect, normally you'll see this stuff here, and then you'll see like public underscore HTML or HTTP docs. You'll need to find out from your web host where you need to upload the files. Now if you use HostGator or Servant.net, it's going to be the public underscore HTML folder. Once you get here, you're probably going to not see anything here. So what you need to do here is create a folder or if you're going to upload it directly to your main site, all you have to do is drag and drop it into here. But because I already have folders here, I'm going to create a new directory called cbtest. Click OK. And this is the location where I will upload the files. Now as you can see here, I've got the files here. And I'm basically going to drag and then drop it here. Now what's happening now is it's uploading the files from my computer to this area here, which is my website. Now that is complete, uh, here are my files right here. And all I've, I'm pretty much done now. Uh, the next thing I need to do is just add this to the, uh, the product page and uh, the site information and so forth. So, for example, you need to know the location of this index.html. If you upload it to a specific site, uh, then go to that main site and you'll be able to find that. So, for example, I uploaded this. Let's see here, I'll go here. Now I uploaded the files, and as you can see, this is a live page. And I'm basically going to go back here and make sure that the link directly to the thank you page is here and the pitch page we're going to talk about in video number nine as to where you put that and the site information 